Hello friends, welcome to our channel. Today we are going to install DeepSeek R1 locally and after that we are going to run the DeepSeek R1 locally and uh, run few examples. So let's get started. So DeepSeek is a new reasoning model from DeepSeek and uh, it comes with a lot of features. It is very cheap as compared to the chat GPT. It is very cheap. DeepSeek API. DeepSeek R1 is also available online and uh, it is costing much lesser than the chat GPT and other Gen AI tools. So uh, we are going to run this locally and then uh, I will show you how you can write few prompts. So go to the olama.com and download the olama for windows download it requires windows 10 or later download is in progress deepseek is also available online and uh, if this is the costing cost is like this and deepseek regional cost is this one so uh, for 1 million tokens input price is 0 0.14 dollar and uh, 1 million input price is 0 0.55 and 1 million tokens output price is 2.19 so this cost is much cheaper than the chat gpt and other uh, models now the olama is uh, downloaded click here and install olama now the installer is started click install Installation is in progress. Installation is about to complete. So Olama is successfully installed. Now open the terminal and type Olama. And if you see this uh, type of output, which means Olama is successfully installed. Now we are going to select the DeepSeek R1 model. Click here and search for DeepSeek R1. So this is the model and it's available in uh, 0 0.5, 1.5 billion, 7 billion, 8 billion, 14 billion, 32 billion, 70 billion, and 671 billion. So I'm going to use the several vinyl model, which is around 4.5 GB. Uh, to use the 7 billion model copy this and run in the terminal olama run deep seek r1 colon 7 billion now it is downloading it's, the size is 4.7 gb let's wait for the download to complete so model has been downloaded successfully now try to test let's ask this question how to make a tea now the model is in process and now it is displaying the output to make the tea follow the simple steps You can see it is using around 80% uh, of my CP. So I have 2.10 GHz, 16 core CPU, and 32 threads.
Chris completed the article and let's ask some question what is the sum of 10 so what is the sum of 10 and 25 let's see So you can see this model is thinking a lot combining the first question and then the second question and uh, thinking a lot so let's see the final output the thinking is started and is still uh, this model is thinking After a lot of thinking, it printed the result sum of 10 and 12 is 35. So, this is a reasoning model and uh, it combines the previous prompts and then the current prompt, and based on that, it gives us the result. In the next video, I will try to see if I can run the 14 uh, billion model on my computer with uh, uh, 64 GB RAM and uh, 16 core processor. So thanks for watching the video and subscribe our channel for more tutorials and videos.